Now, at least have some cooler temperatures to start off the week, and then we will have some warming by midweek into the last half of it. So we're going down a couple days, and we're going to come back up for a couple days. Uh, if you're heading out this morning, we do have some marine layer clouds outside, and then we will have some more mid to high level clouds out there as well due to some monsoonal weather. So the chance of some thunderstorms is still there, uh, and it's going to be feeling a little humid or more so than we're typically used to around here. Now, for downtown LA, we're going to stay in those mid 60s all the way through 9 o'clock. It's so much different compared to what we were seeing last week, so that's nice to see. And we're still going to get warm, though. We're going to get up to about 77 degrees by lunchtime, so you have a couple more hours where you have some more mild temperatures if you want to get out, take your morning walk, your morning run. But we do have uh, some more chances of thunderstorms that are in the forecast for the mountains and deserts. If you're near the foothills, though, some of the valleys, it could sneak across, so just know we could see some more of that. I know we saw that over the weekend always the opportunity for it. It is going to be cooler for a few more days, but it's going to stay a little more humid. And then as we head into Wednesday, we're going to heat it right back up and get hot by the end of the week inland. Les, I'll send it back to you. All right. Thank you. Accidents in this area on both sides of the freeway. The one on the northbound side looks like it's over on the shoulder. However, we are seeing quite a bit of traffic on the northbound side as well. But to so the ABC7 traffic alerts on the southbound side, where we have the HOV and number one lanes that are the only ones open right at Crenshaw Boulevard, it looks like. Uh, and so just know you're going to hit some traffic there on either side we of the freeway. We had some lanes that were blocked off we'll right at Crenshaw Boulevard. Now we have all lanes that are open, so you're good to go to get through it. You won't need to get around. However, a lot of traffic on the northbound side, so just know as you are heading out the door uh, to just make sure you'll leave a little early and allow for some extra time to get through on northbound. All right, we'll have another check in just a little bit. delay on the eastbound side, so it's not the high volume side either, uh, right at Paramount Boulevard where we had one lane blocked, and it does look like that that is cleared now. So some good news. Uh, we have Scott Reif up in here for a couple more days, and then we'll have some warming midweek. The good news is we won't get as hot as we've been seeing lately, so 